And all for the new video. This time we are going to watch another scary video. It will be about the terrifying Notany Cemetery, which is located near Prague. I have to admit that this cemetery is a really big challenge for our team to investigate there. If you want to continue with other videos, then throw the lay people there, comment, it is said that it is not advisable to go to the Newtonice Cemetery alone, it is a very spooky and frightening place surrounded by fog falling after dark and strange winds. The place is located nearby. West Prague does not have a good reputation in any case, those who visited it encountered a number of very strange and rationally inexplicable phenomena. The local church in the cemetery should date from 1352, but the local burial ground is apparently much older, according to the find. People were buried in a crouched position here in prehistoric times, and victims of the plague were buried here much later. In 1862, the cemetery was expanded by a hill with a church. And the cemetery was deserted until 1863. It is said that in that year, the local parish priest planted both the entire cemetery and the area in front of the church. The cemetery is still functional today. It is covered with fairly regular rows of tombstones, and the beautiful sandstone tombstones of Antonine Polythek can be found in the eastern part of the area. Have you told yourself a little about the cemetery? What years it is from? Where it comes from? I have one such short story for you. Now I will tell you a story that happened in this cemetery. Strange noises were clearly heard in the cemetery that were real, I heard voices that no one could make, it was a car honking. The sound came from the exit, when I looked to my surprise no car was standing. Internet hunter Uvardi at night I set out to hunt ghosts with a camera. You said that maybe no ghost would take pictures there. The opposite happened, I have a lot to tell about. When I decided to take pictures, my camera refused to take pictures of some graves. A little further away, I heard the mysterious footsteps of someone invisible, which his friends heard anyway. Local witnesses also tell about similar things, they mention that strange lights in the fog moving over the graves, about shadows and sudden movement of the wind, ghosts. The local dead or at least some of them definitely do not rest in peace. But who could it be? A search in history or in the Newtonic Cemetery will remind us of the victims of the plague. The graves of stranglers, who were buried here already in prehistoric times. The souls of such unfortunates do not find peace even after death and often appear in places connected with their life and death. The unfortunate countess can also now walk among the graves in the Newtonic Cemetery or appear at the place of her death. And perhaps also at his former residence in the castle in Statenis. But the castle is hardly there because it is now in such a terrible state that they would scare the ghost. Alright guys, it's over now. It is certainly a very big challenge for us as our investigation team, and I would really like to carry out our investigation there in this cemetery. If you liked this video and I will be happy if there you shove it like a comment share it on social networks, will you subscribe? Well, we'll see you soon for another video like this. Have a nice day.